The NFL Draft is nearly here, and the mock drafts are increasing in both frequency, as well as speed. While other sources are going with the traditional style of slideshow mock drafts are those created in articles, NFL Network's Good Morning Football is going with a different approach. On Friday morning, Kay Adams, Peter Schrager, Kyle Brandt, and guest host Sean O'Hara took part in the mock draft to guess at the first 12 picks on April 25th. What made this mock different, apart from the name, is how it was laid out. Schrager and Brandt were the ones making picks for each team, bouncing back and forth with each selection. To make their choices unique, each fake general manager only had 10 seconds to make their selection. If they missed out on the pick before the time ran out, they became the Minnesota Vikings from 2003. 10 seconds between picks. Teams 1-12. to Here's how the inaugural GMFB mock draft turned out, picked at twitter.com slash 9 GMFB at GMFB April 19, 2019 Starting off, there was no surprise when Schrager selected quarterback Kyler Murray while acting as the Arizona Cardinals. However, the anticipated moves ended right there. Instead of slotting Nick Bosa to the San Francisco 49ers, Brent opted for Alabama defensive tackle Quinnen Williams. This shook up the mock draft and opened up an opportunity for Schrager to take the Ohio State defensive end and place him on the New York Jets. For the Raiders, this should have been fine. Sure, they missed out on both Williams and Bosa, but Josh Allen from Kentucky and Evan White from LSU were still available. The Raiders could add a premier pass rusher without moving up or down. Well, Brent shook up the draft even more by opting for Rishon Gary out of Michigan. While this move caught the hosts by surprise, it does fit with what the Raiders are looking to do on defense. Getting more production from the edge rushers is a top priority, as is improving run defense. Gary is someone that can aid in both pursuits after tallying 23 tackles for a loss and 9.5 sacks in his three-year career. Pairing these numbers with his 119 combined tackles at Michigan shows that Gary is one of the top options in the class. Oakland has been tied to Williams and Allen throughout this early pre-draft process, but there is interest in Gary. He was in the Bay Area this week visiting the team and had previously met with the Raiders at the NFL Scouting Combine. During this meeting, Gary confidently told the team that he is the man who can improve upon the 13 sacks in 2018. Additionally, he would love the opportunity to reunite with his college teammate and defensive tackle Maurice Hurst. Man, if I had an opportunity to be a Raider, I would love it. I miss my man, Mo, Gary said at the prospect of playing with his former teammate. Well, if this Good Morning Football mock draft is any indication, Gary will soon be hearing his name called by the Raiders, followed shortly by a phone call with Gian Gruden and Mark Mayock. Although the decision makers will have much longer than 10 seconds to make their selection. Let's block ads. Why?